6, mystery at sea, the Coast Guard saving two boaters in the waters off South Florida. And a captain who saw them says he has questions about their story. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live on Hullover Beach with more. Peter. Well, Ruta Bay, the Coast Guard says it was 10 minutes after noon when a call came in from a good Samaritan about a boat that was stranded with two men on board off Hallover Beach. That vessel right now is docked here at the Hallover Marine Center. Amid this strange sight, if you look closely, the engine cover is missing. We spoke with a good Samaritan. Captain Charlie says he was on his charter boat on a fishing trip 12 miles off Hallover Beach and headed back to shore when he spotted these two men and their vessel adrift. On the way back in, I saw a vessel that looked a little weird, you know, out of the normal. It's what I figured as a captain so that they could, you know, be on the wind, being they had no power. He was careful. Didn't get too close because you never know what goes on in these things. I grew up born and raised around here and funny things can happen. So I got close enough to see two occupants. Um, they seemed to be okay. They were weathered. They were, they were, they were sunburnt. The Coast Guard says the men said they were fishing off Marathon when their boat became disabled two days ago. It says their 22-foot cuddy cabin was found five miles east of Hallover Beach. Miami Fire Rescue towed it to the Hallover Marine Center, where a Coast Guard Zodiac stopped by to take pictures. Captain Charlie says the boat looks suspicious. The cowling is off the motor, meaning that they obviously had engine issues if the engine ever ran. And um, like I said, nine, 10 miles offshore, there was no fishing rods on the boat. Just two guys like, what are you guys doing out here 10 miles offshore adrift? You know, it looked kind of funny. So. Captain Charlie was at least 50 yards away from the men, but tried to speak with them. I could kind of see that they were okay. I didn't make any communication. They were Spanish. I'm half Cuban, so I know they were speaking Spanish. The Coast Guard says there are unanswered questions. They had uh, communication equipment initially that was just malfunctioning. And Captain Charlie realizes that he may have saved two lives. Hopefully they're all right. If they are Cubans, they're going back to, that's just the way that rolls now. And um, hopefully two humans didn't die. I just, just did what I was taught to do, you know. Don't approach the vessel that close and call for help. Captain Charlie says it's the first time in his 10 years as a charter boat captain that he's come across a stranded vessel with people on board. The Coast Guard tells us he wants to know why those two men were unable to communicate with anyone over the past two days. The last check, they were still on board the Coast Guard cutter being questioned. We're live at the Hallover Marina. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News. Rudabay.